Mantis Bug Tracker is a free and open source, web-based bug tracking system released under the terms of the GNU General Public License version 2. The most common use of Mantis BT is to track software defects. However, Mantis BT is often configured by users to serve as a more generic issue tracking system and project management tool. The name Mantis and the logo of the project refer to the Mantidae family of insects, known for the tracking of and feeding on other insects, colloquially referred to as bugs. The name of the project is typically abbreviated to either Mantis BT or just Mantis. History Kanzaburo Ito started development of the Mantis bug tracking project in 2000. In 2002 Victor Bokta became the maintainer of the project. Version 1.0.0 was released in February 2006. Version 1.1.0 was released in December 2007. In November 2008, after a long discussion, the project switched from using the subversion revision control tool to Git a distributed revision control tool. In February 2010, version 1.2.0 was released. In July 2012, the Mantis BT organization on GitHub became the official repository for the project's source code. Features, plugins, an event-driven plugin system was introduced with the release of version 1.2.0. This plugin system allows extension of Mantis BT through both officially maintained and third party plugins. As of November 2013, there are over 50 plugins available on the Mantis BT plugins organization on GitHub. Prior to version 1.2.0, a third party plugin system created by Vincent Debout was available to users along with a variety of different plugins. This system was not officially supported by the Mantis BT project and is incompatible with Mantis BT 1.2.0 and later. Notifications Mantis BT supports the sending of email notifications upon changes being made to issues in the system. Users have the ability to specify the type of emails they receive and set filters to define the minimum severity of issues to receive notifications about. Users also have the ability to explicitly subscribe to issues that affect them. RSS feeds are available for users who wish to keep track of issues that have been resolved. Additionally, Mantis BT has integration with Twitter via a plugin, to allow a notification to be tweeted when an issue is resolved. Via Mantis BT's event-driven plugin system, it is possible to extend the built-in notification support to run advanced scripts that perform additional notification actions. Revision Control System Integration Versions of Mantis BT prior to 1.2.0 allowed for limited integration with the CVS Revision Control System. With the introduction of plugin capabilities in Mantis BT 1.2.0, Revision control integration was redeveloped by John Rees in the Source Integration Plugin. The initial release of the Source Integration Plugin supported GitHub, GitWeb, SourceForge and WebSVN. Over time, two additional modules were added and as of November 2013, Source Integration is supported for the following revision control tools and web-based providers, CGIT, a web interface for Git repositories, written in C, GitHub an open-source software hosting facility that hosts Git repositories, GitHub, a free and open-source web interface for Git repositories, HGWeb, a CGI web front-end for Mercurial repositories, SourceForge, an open-source software hosting facility that hosts various types of software repositories, WebSVN, a free and open-source web interface for subversion repositories, Road Code, an open-source web interface to Mercurial and Git repositories, upon committing changes ETS to a source code repository, post commit hooks within Git or subversion can be configured to automatically notify Mantis BT that changes have been made to the repository. GitHub is also capable of remotely notifying a Mantis BT installation of changes to a source code repository. Another technique used for integrating Mantis BT with web-based source code hosting providers is the use of a job scheduler such as Cron to manually check for changes to a repository every few minutes, reporting any changes back to Mantis BT. Source integration allows for issues within Mantis BT to be automatically resolved when a changes at message contains special strings such as fixes number 12345.
which are configurable using regular expressions. This also allows for relationships to be automatically created between changes ETS and corresponding issues recorded in Mantis BT. Multiple issue IDs can be specified in a single changes ET message, although this is commonly discouraged as it indicates the changes ET doesn't have a single, clear and logical purpose. Minor features, in addition to the features mentioned above, Mantis BT also has support for full text search, audit trails of changes made to issues, revision control of text fields and notes, roadmaps, changer logs, graphing of relationships between issues, sponsorship of issues, wiki documentation integration for DocuWiki, MediaWiki, Twiki, WikiWiki and XWIKI, news, project management and time tracking with Kadeft. Localized dozens of languages on TranslateWiki.net. Technical design, development languages, Mantis BT is mainly written in PHP and uses SQL to interface with databases. The web-based user interface of Mantis BT is written using HTML which is styled and presented using CSS. The UI also uses the jQuery client-side JavaScript library to provide optional features such as Ajax and JSON powered dynamic page content. Development tools and built scripts are written predominantly in Python with some shell script and PHP. Mantis BT's code base dates back to a time when PHP's support for object-oriented programming principles was in its infancy. As of version 1.2.0, the majority of the Mantis BT code base still uses procedural programming principles, however some sections have been converted to make use of 5 Philippine Pesos S new object model. Database Storage Data is stored in a relational database management system by means of the ADODB database abstraction library. Mantis BT supports MySQL. Support for other databases is known to be problematic. The development team are looking to fix this for the 2.0 release. Mantis BT maintains a database upgrade path between versions by modifying the database schema incrementally. During the installation of Mantis BT, database schema modifications are replayed all the way back from early versions of Mantis BT to reach the latest state. Requirements Mantis BT requires a configured web server, the PHP programming language interpreter and a relational database management system supported by Mantis BT and ADODB. The stable branch of Mantis BT requires 5.1 Philippine pesos.0 or later. For the development branch, the minimum PHP version is 5.3.2. Several PHP extensions are required to enable specific functionality or for performance reasons. The extension for the RDBMS being used is mandatory. Mantis BT bundles a number of dependencies with each release including, ADODB for abstraction of support for relational database management systems, Disposable for disposable email checking functionality, EZ components for plotting of statistics, New SOAP for SOAP web service support, Mailer for email sending support, Projax for Ajax capabilities in the user interface, RSS Builder for RSS feed support, PHP UTF-8 wrapper library for internationalization support in absence of PHP's MB string extension, for drawing graphs of relationships between issues. Graph is is required. Mantis BT also has an alternative dependency upon the commercial JP Graph Graphics Library for plotting of statistics. See also Comparison of issue tracking systems, references. External links, official website.